Hey guys, this is Devin with HDPiano.com, and we're taking a look at Purpose by Justin Bieber. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to play the intro. And of course, the rest can be found over at HDPiano.com. But here we go. Let me show you what we're doing today. All right, nice and simple, but that's kind of the theme, the running theme throughout the entire song, which I have to say is one of my favorite Bieber tunes just because the performance is really touching and the piano playing is, is top notch for sure. So before we get started, this song is in the key of C, which you may know is all white notes. So it's funny, we will not actually be playing a single black note in this entire video. Crazy, right? I mean, in this entire series, the whole song, even all that fancy stuff at the end. It's all white notes. Which leads me to this next question. How many notes in total are in this song? Comment below what you think. It's not as many as you might think. I'm not talking specific notes, but just how many different notes, right? All right, let's dive in. So we start off with an F major. F and C in the left. And middle C, by the way, is right here. So we're starting off nice and high. F and C in the left, A in the right. Now, left hand is going to go take that same shape and move it down to C, right? These are fifths. All right? While the right hand plays the melody. That melody being A, B, A, G, E. A, B, A, B, G. Now, get that under your fingers because it must occur a hundred times in this song. All right, those are the first two measures. One, two, and three, and four. One, two, three, four. Then we start here, A minor seven voicing. A, G in the left hand, C and G in the right hand. Now these Gs are gonna repeat each time, and our thumb and pinky are gonna walk up. With a little grace note in the right hand there. That thing. All right. So that's A and G, C and G. B and G, D and G in the right hand. And uh, lead into C and G and E and G. So that those two measures look like this. All right. And then there's a little pick up into the next two measures that's like this. Alright, so we take this shape with our right hand, a G and an E, and we just move it stepwise. So F and D, E and C. Starting here, G and E, we just step it down the piano, right? Just down the white notes. And the left hand, a little different, C, A, G. All right, three and four into the next measure, which is exactly like the beginning of the intro, but just down an octave. So that's right, F voicing with that melody. All right, so that's good. Same thing as we already know, as we already learned. And then we end it with nice, rich, low tones on the piano. Oh yeah, and I gotta say, whoever mixed this record made that piano sound like a luscious, just like, wow, what a fat sound, just so rich and so full of low end and really nice. If you haven't put it on speakers and you know, listen to the high fidelity version, I suggest it. For those audio files out there. So what are we working with? Octave A's in the left hand, A and A, walking up to C, or yeah. A and A, B and B, and then a fifth, C and G. All right, so octave, octave, fifth on C. Fifth because if you count it, one, two, three, four, five, right? So, and in the right hand, fifths as well, F and C, G and D, 
and then a C major chord, E, G, and C. Put those together. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. But we can add a little grace note, like this. All right, leading into that G and D, play a little C. And that's where Bieber comes in. So that's the entire intro to Purpose by Justin Bieber. Let me play it one more time for you guys so you can see it all in context. All right, Justin Bieber really pulling the heartstrings on this one. That is a, a lovely little intro. And I'm sorry to cut it short right before he's supposed to come in, right? Well, that's your job. Head over to hdpiano.com to see the rest of these videos where I'm going to break down the rest of the song. And I got to say, this is one of the more challenging songs I've, I've had the, the opportunity to teach. And it's a very visual experience. I'm just going to break it down, kind of go two measures by it at a time. Because it's, a, it's the same chords throughout the whole song, but because it's such a raw, emotional, improvised performance, there's all sorts of variety. And yeah, that's what I'm going to show you. Just take it nice and slow and kind of dive into the brain of you know, the amazing pianist that really did this song justice. So we'll see you over at hdpiano.com, home of the hybrid piano lesson. In the meantime, give us a shout at Twitter, at hdpiano. We take your requests. We're happy to cover you know, whatever it is you want to learn. Instagram, we're happy to repost your performances at HD Piano as well. And give us a like on Facebook, HD Piano. I'm Devin with HDPiano.com, and we'll see you over at the site. Have a great day. Keep up the piano playing. Thanks, guys. See ya.